world where I am in the Americas. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I am here in the US of A. I decided to do a quick little vlog just to tell you some stories about what's going on. Yeah, you can't see shit right now, but there's Muzzle Fuzzle. Yo. Looking extremely sunburned. We just had KFC and it's made me feel sick. Like, oh, whoa, it looks like Predator's aiming at me there. One sec. Wait. Whoa, whoa, there's loads of products aiming at me. Anyway, um, story time. Got back to the US and there's loads of maggots there. And if you look all there on everything, all the windows and the mirrors and this, maybe that. They, they, no, they are maggots that have evolved into flies. They're not maggots. They were maggots that evolved into flies. You can have a look at my vine. What? They're fruit flies. Don't believe Where them. do fruit flies come from? Don't believe Tom, they're fruit flies. Where did the fruit flies come from? Fruit. Maggots. I got you. Science. Science, bitch. Anyway, so yeah, I'm back. I've made that way out. I'm back out in the States for like 23 days now. Um, that went down, but this is more like story time because one, that little maggot festation happened. And then two, there's dog pubes everywhere. There's like, Literally more dog hair here than mine and mother's beards combined. Uh, three. I don't know what this is. I think the dog just went crazy. And then four. When I came into my... I'm going to say the embarrassment of any rudeness here. But come into my, my bathroom and I'm like, Oh yeah, my bathroom It's hopefully going to be alright. And I'm like, what is that black thing on the floor right there? What is that? What could that possibly be? Dog hair? No. It's clearly where the Griswold... Is going to Tucker's room, got his girlfriend's thong, and dragged it and dropped it in my bathroom. So I've got a feeling Griswold has humped the goddamn shit out of that thong. At least he didn't leave it on my pillow, and I just like walking in like, What the fuck, Tucker, did you do in my room? But uh, yeah, that's it. So I'm back in the States now. I'm out here for like 23 days. The dog's clearly been cruising in here because look at it. Yeah, Tucker will clean up his dog hair. Of course he will. Look at it, it's everywhere. I just, I, I should just start like every day picking up the hair like this and then just leaving it there like a pile outside his. I'll put it in a big jar and at the end of it, see how big the, the jar of hair is. And we could donate it to like kids who want afros or something. I don't fucking know. But um, yeah, I made it out to the States. Um, it's absolutely fucking boiling. My room is 8 degrees. If that means it's hot, it's fucking hot. We don't have AC in this building. Uh, at all, it's just uh, I've got an AC unit, no one else does. I'm the only one with one, and yeah, it's pretty goddamn hot right now. So, I'm gonna crack my window, close my curtains, and I'm gonna get in bed, chill out, and I'm going to watch some Netflix because it is actually, I have no idea what time it is. Oh, it's 10 o'clock, so it's only 10 o'clock at night, but uh, it is actually half past 6 uh, a.m. in the UK, so pretty tired, uh, but. Something everyone's been asking me to do is to do daily vlogs on this channel again. Now, it's really not difficult because uh, whilst I'm out in the States, I've got LTE internet, which means it's like really fast upload. So, a vlog, I should just be able to upload. Um, and there will be days where I don't do anything exciting, and it will just be a daily catch up like this to tell you what I've done, or to show you something funny, or to show you someone I'm, who I'm with. But I think I'm going to do it on this channel just for the next 23 days. So, if you want to join in, subscribe. Yes. This is me with flat hair. What? Why? I, why it's flat? I don't know. But I'm actually kind of liking it being flat, just because it's so much easier just to have it go like that and look straight and neat on each side, rather than it being spiked up and then one side being like swag and one side being like swag. So that's about that. That's a foot. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. Uh, am I gonna do them at a set time? Probably not. Probably not. And I might even record more than one more then one in one day and upload it if I feel there's something necessary I want to upload and share with you guys but um, I don't think there's really anything I need to share with you guys apart from me and Muzzer just went on an adventure that we got a t we got a taxi because I was sat there starving my face off I was like absolutely starving I was like I'm gonna go down and get some like hoagie wings some like chicken wings but the place was closed from Eat 24 that was closed so I was like damn it what do I do so I decided to order an Uber X, which cost us nine dollars, so like six, no, about five quid, to go down to the shop, go and do all our shopping for food and drinks and stuff like that, 
bought my first crate, like, handle of six uh, beers legally because I'm now 21 in the US. Like, I say me legally buy it just because it's... I meant to say it's just like I've, I can now legally buy them. This was my first one purchased. Everyone was like, "What do you mean you bought them illegally?" No, because I don't have a fake ID. It's impossible. You have to look about. Th I think it's you have to look thirty in the US to not get ID'd. And I first time I ever came out to LA when I was seventeen, nearly eighteen. I think no, eighteen. I think um, some dude at a bar that I went to go into the bar just to chill out with my friends. Um, as I was going in there, he looked about sixty, and his wife looked like forty. And they both got ID'd, and I was like, what the hell is going on with this world? LA, you're so drunk. Um, but yeah, so I'm now 21, I can buy alcohol legally in the US, and I am going to get so drunk. Yeah! Oh my god, I'm about to buy my first crate of alcohol. Because I'm now 21 and it's legal. Do it for the vine. I'm going to do it.